Tony Hawk. The people know Tony Hawk as an icon now. They don't know Tony Hawk's story. Well, the thing is, I think, I think people mythologize Tony Hawk. They look at him now, he's the most uh, recognizable alternative athlete in the world. Most recognizable. Yeah. Has a high Q rating, and high, uh, as high a Q rating as, like, you know, Michael Jordan. And here he is, when he was a little kid growing up, becoming Tony Hawk. He stumbled, he had ter you know, terrific obstacles, but most importantly, the people in, the, in his own sport didn't really like the way he did what he did. Right. They didn't like the way he skateboarded. Yeah, and they gave they, a lot of crap for the way he skateboarded. People hated on Tony Hawk when yes, he was young. Yes, big time. So, okay, so Tony... Uh, and, and we deal with that in the film, that, yeah. that he struggled with this. And he struggled with the fact that he couldn't be accepted. They didn't want to accept who he was. What, he, what no one realized at the time was that Tony was doing tricks that were 10 years ahead of their time. But everyone else was looking at him and expecting him to fit in, and he wasn't. He was too far beyond. The really fascinating thing is I think you guys also invented a way of sports marketing. And I don't know if you were aware at the time you were doing this, but the way marketing changed with you guys, you took skateboard ads with skateboarders, mm -hmm. and there were no skateboards in them. There was no right. mention. No, it was all about ideas and image. It yeah. was the imagery and it was ideas, and it was a way to showcase their personalities. How did you know to do that, or did you know to do that? I did know to do it because I was smart enough to hire Craig Stesick to do it because I knew I couldn't do it myself. And I knew that we had to break the tradition. We couldn't just uh, have pictures of our products because no one cared about that. They didn't care about that. What people want is they want something to cling to, a dream. They want a dream to cling to, and we were there trying to create a dream, a mythology about our company.